There's the tie rod end right there. There's the ball joint. It's got to come out. That's going to be some work. Better get to it. talk about this setup here for a minute. 
Now, the only reason why I'm going to be using my, well, I'm talking about this, is because I haven't found anything that's halfway decent for me to understand how to use this tool. I rented this from an O'Reilly's not far from where I'm at. And it's obvious that I'm not a mechanic because it took me 45 minutes to try to figure out how I'm supposed to use this thing. I've seen people use it like this, and I've seen people use it like this, okay? Now, this is a 2004 Dodge Caravan. It appears as though I'm going to have to use this tool in this fashion, okay? So here's what I've got. Depending on how you look at this, this piece here, which the tool manufacturer calls a removing adapter, which is different than this one which they call an installing adapter. Removing adapter, installing adapter. This may not be rocket science for an auto mechanic, but I'm not an auto mechanic. Okay, so here's what we've got. I have to take the removing adapter and place it on here so that it seats over the ball joint stud so that this surface here presses against this shoulder here. Then this goes on here like so. I take the installing adapter set that in there and then I take this receiving cup and place it on there and tighten this whole assembly against the control arm so that what's being pressed on is this shoulder here and this cup will receive, it goes around the body of the ball joint and presses against the control arm. So this presses against the control arm, this presses against that shoulder. Now if I've done this correctly, when I start to press this out, when I start, when I put my breaker bar on here and I start reefing on this, that should fall down. 